so we're starting to go on the final track, end track. We're almost there. Now, center console, shift A. Let's go a box, cube, size scale, so it fits in between the chairs. Seems pretty good. Size Z. Let's just get that into place. So probably about here, I say. Looks pretty good. Let's put a few loot cups in. Uh, let's select this face. Mm, actually, let's go size, size Y. Let's bring that to about here. Okay. And proportional editing again by pressing O. And let's bring that up. So we've kind of got that. However, when I drive a car, I want to be able to rest my elbow on there. So that's probably a good height right there. I'm going to do a control R to put an edge loop in and right click to recenter that. Let's just get those, these vertices on this side, delete faces, and we'll put in a mirror modifier. So now we've got both sides. The next thing I would like to do is I'm going to grab these surfaces. Shift D X. So we've got the exact same layout. I'm just going to go extrude on the X axis. And let's put the proportional editing back on. Actually, I'm going to select this face for proportional editing. I did not turn it on. Oh. And so let's try and get that curve happening. Now I can get rid of that face because we don't need it. We could get rid of these faces because we don't need them. Get rid of these bottom faces because we don't need them either. Delete faces, delete faces. All right. And we can get rid of these ones. Delete faces. And so we've got a center console thing happening here. All right. Let's do R. I want to cut out this corner here. Let's do R in there. Delete face. Now we've got a bit of up here. So let's just move that in. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa. Control Z, control Z. Turn on proportional editing, but move it all the way down. Okay. And that's sitting directly in there. Um, let's just move that one over. This is sitting in the dashboard. So how about we move this bit down a little bit? There we go. Now, let we'll add in a subdivision surface to just round it all off. And I'm just going to tidy it up a little bit. That's looking nice. There we go. It's got a real nice kind of center console there. Um, we'll probably maybe put some compartments in there afterwards. Let's now fill in this back area. Now I was wondering, what can I do to fill it in? Um, we spoke about this bit here before, um, could have been for storage, but I think maybe that could be just a mechanical access. And I kind of want to just fill this back area in. So I'm just going to do a shift A cylinder and rotate that on the X axis. Now the reason why we've got this space is because we had a very loose concept drawing. So if I come back to here, let's just, oops, come on. If I just move this up, you can see that we had the character sitting all the way back over here and the dash was a lot higher, but that's fine. Um, whereas now we've got a two seated cockpit. Now, in hindsight, 
a little bit of a bad design because I think maybe this should have been more over here and but I mean we will learn from our mistakes um, so we've got we're trying to fill this back area in size X okay now we don't need this face let's move this in so we can't see it and we can get rid of a whole bunch of these faces but first what we need to do is I'm going to select this face because we need to get rid of this face I'm going to insert by pressing I it's going to bring that all the way down that doesn't work I all right what do we got it's a fish I let's get it down as much as possible let's get rid of some of these un unneeded so I'm going to select these faces delete faces I'm going to select this select this let's select that size Z zero there we go size X let's just push that out a little bit beautiful and now we can go about pushing all these this in okay and so what I'm trying to do is I'm just trying to show you the concepts of kind of my thought process I know I could have put a mirror modifier like I've done for everything else, but I'm just going to do these quickly like that. And I'm going to select those. I'm going to do a control B. Smooth. And so now when I put in our glass, it kind of fills it all out which is a lot better. All right. I think in the next part, we might start putting on a few meshes, uh, a few materials. Um, we still need to work on the joystick and probably just some finer details on the inside. Maybe we might put some doors in here and, but yeah, we're slowly getting there.